Hi, and welcome to this walkthrough for running customer success and onboarding in HubSpot. First of all, a huge thanks to everyone who showed their support on LinkedIn. My goal here really is to provide a framework and some ideas and inspiration for your own process when it comes to running onboarding customer success in HubSpot. So what we'll cover in depth, how and why HubSpot isn't just a great tool for marketing and sales, but is actually a good fit for onboarding and customer success as well. And this guide will be split up into seven chapters, which you can use individually or all together to run the process across the entire customer journey. So even if you have less than an hour total to spare, you can dive into the topics that are most interesting to you. So who am I? I'm Stuart Balcom. I am a product marketer at Arrows. We build customer facing action plans that integrate with your internal workflow in HubSpot. I'm also a total onboarding and customer success nerd. So this is really fun to do. Okay, let's get into it. So what we'll cover? First off, why use HubSpot for onboarding and CS and how to do a sort of basic setup, which objects to use, which plan needs to be on, those kinds of things. Next, this is probably the most requested topic, which is how do you manage the handoff from sales to onboarding and ongoing success in HubSpot? Then we'll get into using product data in HubSpot, how to build success plans and playbooks in HubSpot. And then coming probably next week will be workflows and automations, how to run tasks internally, and then reporting on all things onboarding and customer success. So let's dive right in to section one. 